Hello to all, I am a basket case and today I will be playing Nightmare Files Clap Clap. Now from what I've read, looking at the description on Steam as well as itch.io where I saw it first, we are playing as a house sitter and obviously some spooky shit is gonna happen. Admittedly, I am a little late to playing this game as it got very popular rather quickly with a lot of the big YouTubers that I follow playing it, but whatever, I'm here now. And I figure it's a great game to get back into doing YouTube. Also, I want to say the first two things that came to my mind when I saw this game. Obviously, the old Clapper advertisements, you know. Also, I had just rewatched The Conjuring and their little hide and clap game where the, the entity claps in the closet. Spoilers if you haven't seen it for some reason. And I'm feeling like it's going to be a little bit closer to that. So without further ado, let's get rid of me rambling and me right into this game. Okay, October 8th, 1984. I saw an ad in the newspaper about a house sitting job. Since I was short on cash, uh, same, I decided to sign up. All right, quite the eerie neighborhood, huh? I'm assuming I'm talking to myself. Oh, look at this. There's actually a dude out here. Look at this dude. What? What are you doing? Clap, clap, cereal? What is that? Do I hit E to interact with you? No, I click on you. Excuse me, I'm trying to find a house on the street. Could you help me out? Do I, do I hit skip? No, oh, sure. Sure. Which house are you looking for? I'm looking for Maxim's place. He hired me to look after it while he's away. Maxim? Oh, huh, that's interesting. He usually asks me to watch his place. I'm Marco Batovsky, by the way. Nice to meet you, Marco. Can you tell me where his house is? Of course. It's two houses down. Mine's right here, our neighbor Savo in the middle, and then Maxim's place. You can't miss it. Thanks, Marco. Appreciate it. No problem. Now, if you'll excuse me, I just got my home automation system in the mail. I'm really excited. Oh, that sounds interesting. What does it do? Exposition. Well, it's supposed to make life a whole lot easier. You know, controlling the lights, temperature, even the security system. Pretty cool stuff. Wow, that does sound convenient. Why did you decide to get it? Partly because of the recent disappearances happening around here. Fun. But mainly because our neighbor Savo got one and won't stop raving about it. He left for vacation right after installing it. Said it has built-in surveillance systems and all. Guess he wanted to keep an eye on things while he's away. Well, I hope you enjoy setting it up. Thanks again for the directions, Marco. No problem. If you need anything, I'm just a house away. I see, but why are you kind of like still rummaging through your mail? Interesting. So this is Savo's place then. Can I sprint? Okay, there's a little bit of a sprint. And he doesn't even have his porch lights on or nothing. Yeah, this must be it. Oh, that was the scratchy. Enter the house. Man. Bold for that. Oh, I have arms. Bold for there to be no, like, thing. Hmm, I think the homeowner mentioned the keys would be in the backyard. Ooh. Should go around the back. I guess... That's not the way around the back. Hopefully there's a gate on this side. Nope, no gate even. Hmm. I think they said they'd put it in the flower pots. In the flower pots, in the flower pot. I'm going to assume it's that right there. The easily distinguishable key. Uh, there we are. Let's see if these work. I don't like how the ambient, like, little music stopped. Can I... It's got to work on the back door, right? No. Not even highlightable. It is eerily quiet out here. Is Marco still there? Marco is not there. All right. I don't think I see anybody else. I've got, like, old flashbacks to my goddamn childhood. I used to live in relatively the same kind of position in a neighborhood quite like this, minus the whole billboard. Didn't have a billboard there, but I lived in a neighborhood very similar to this in a very similar like placed house so just weird bit of flashbacks there it is holy shit, it's dark as all right i have entered the house and i can't see oh, that's a uh, welcoming indeed 
I'm assuming that jump start, jump scare music, they did say it was a smart house, was, uh, you know, for us mostly. I don't like how that seems to be relatively open. Loud fan. No blinds or curtains on any of these windows. That's annoying. Hey, thanks for house sitting. Please make sure to check the mailbox, water the plants, throw out the trash. P.S. Press Q to toggle the lights on and off in any room. P.S.S. Once you're finished, help yourself to the food in the kitchen. Got it. A to-do list. Just like at home. Time to get acquainted with this place. I think I should take a quick tour of all the rooms. It is a clapper. A f clapper for the closet, though. Is that a femur bone? Is that a femur? All right, let's... Toilet. Let's see. With the little, uh... I can... Oh, it's a big top button. I see. I'm starting to get the feeling I know what's about to happen in this game. And I'm not a big fan of it. I mean, I'm a fan of it, but I'm not, I'm not gonna enjoy it when it happens. I just gotta remember, this is just, just a game. What is this? Clap, clap, home automated systems. Clapper Town, California. Turning your house into a smart house. Order 45,621. On the, uh, okay, so 97 bucks. That seems relatively cheap compared to what I think it is now for like, you know, Google Home and Alexa and whatnot. Okay. Six bedrooms, huh? Uh, that was an interesting look. Picture. How to kill a house sitter. Mmm. Do you think this is a clue to certain events that may or may not happen? I don't know. Oh! I don't even have to physically... I can actually just push a door open. Okay. Okay. I didn't even do that. Oh, no. It's just a heavy door. I see. And what is this? Horror 101. Okay. Again. What is this? 100 jump scare ideas. Now let's talk about the to-do list. First, gotta grab the mail. So, I gotta point out the fact that there's Horror 101, how to, like, 100 jump scare ideas. That was real echoey. And how to kill a house sitter. What is this? How to be a mystery killer. I think... I think we're in a Scream movie. I think I'm being directed by Wes Craven right now. Okay. Missing, please help. 25 years old, 170 pounds, 5 foot 9 inches seen on the 21st september 1984 on southwood park wearing a black sweater and a black hat he was doing house sitting services this sounds like the beginning of a mystery novel wonder what happened i'm don't know but i'm going to assume all these books now it's time to show those plants who's boss You know what? Kid, I'm out of here. I've seen this movie. There's too much going on right now. I've seen this movie, and I don't seem to be armed in any way. I'm just gonna go home. That's, like, this job. I don't need it. I'm gonna go home now. Let me just get the gun up. I can't. Hooray! I gotta do it! Hey, Marco! Uh, Marco! I have some concerns about the person I'm working for. I can't even get up here. 
I can't even go to Marco for help. I'm alone. I'm in this situation. Like, this is bad. I'm screwed. I'm dead. I'm a white guy in a horror movie. That's what I am. Is that a light on up there? I don't know what that is. But yeah, I am a white guy. Oh, grab the watering can from the garage. I am a white guy in a horror movie. Now I know, yes, I'm white, but I'm not white. As you saw, I just tried leaving because there is so much wrong with this scene. So much. Hmm. Okay, there we go. Whoops. So if I do this. I'm gonna go through the house, is what I'm gonna do. Hopefully I don't need to refill that. And then obviously close the door behind me. I don't care what anybody says. Leaving any door open is just asking to be killed. I am watering the plants. Maybe. Okay. Those ones. Oh, I see. Oh, there was a bar that I didn't see either because it was... Hello? Either because it was hidden behind uh, the bushes or what? Why at night? Why, why at night, though? I couldn't get a cab to bring me here earlier in the day? I had to come here at night. The worst time. I swear I'm hearing an another set of footsteps. I am. I am. I just heard another set of footsteps. Those those were not my footsteps. Those yeah, you hear that. Those aren't mine. Those are not mine. I got a watering can. I'm not afraid to use it. I'll drown your ass. Waterboard you. That's what I'm gonna do. I also got ta chairs beside me, and I watched a lot of WWE growing up. I know what to f do with chairs. I don't care if these aren't the metal ones. Wood splinters. And then I got a stake. Stab you. Alright, next is the trash can from the kitchen. I'm not putting this back. I can stay out here. I'm just gonna hope that the footsteps that I was hearing were coming from somebody else's backyard. That is what I'm going to do. I will, however, turn that off. And close that. Right. Bags heavier than I expected. Those are bones. And what's with these bones sticking out? I'm going to assume that that missing house sitter? No. Bags. Oh, it's just. You, you. Sucker. I am Agent Rustolano, Federal Investigation Bureau, FIB. Oh, sh I'm in the GTA universe. I'm really dead. I need to ask you a few questions. Sure. What's this about? There have been reports of disturbances in this area. Disappearances, strange phenomena. We're conducting an investigation. Yeah, I've heard. Everything's fine here. I'm just taking out the trash. Everything's not fine here. There was a bunch of books that say otherwise. Are you sure? We've reason to believe there's more to this neighborhood than meets the eye. Yeah, 100%. Just taking out the trash, you know. Alright, but keep your eyes and ears open. We need to get to the bottom of this. I heard footsteps when I was in the backyard earlier. 
watering plants. Of course, will do. Thanks, Inspector. No problem. Stay safe out there. Balls. Sucker. Christ. Stepped over the plants, huh? Me. Me. Okay. Just gonna kind of watch him. You know what I mean? Gonna watch him go. Just gonna watch him leave. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, that's not closing anytime soon. And there he goes. He's able to leave the neighborhood. I, on the other hand, am stuck here. All right. Now that my heart is... Hey, Agent. Um, there is for sure somebody in that house. For sure, there is somebody. I saw your arm, mother... I saw your arm. Uh, wonder, can I see him standing? No, he's gotta be hiding then. You all saw that. I'm not f crazy. Obviously, we heard the clap. And that's the point. I don't know why I closed the front. He's gonna close it on me anyways. He's like in one of these closets where he went upstairs. The, uh, this is this is it. This is my death. Not even gonna comment on that, huh? Not even gonna comment on that. Elements of fear. Didn't even notice that book. Is there like a uh, is there like a kitchen knife I can take or something? Nothing. I really am white. I'm just gonna walk upstairs. Not where I left you. Snooping around can get you in trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's like, do you got a, do you got a blicky in here? Nothing. See this. Zoom. Zoom. Rotate this. Shit. How to kill a house sitter. I got a book. Oh, I can actually maybe use that. God damn it. These doors suck. I hate these doors. All lights staying on from now on. Your power bill. No, you for sure heard that. And you're not even going to talk about how this is all of a sudden not on that door. Even though you for sure fucking saw it. Good God. How white am I? God. I'm going to come in here and I'm going to die. Okay. No dark corner. Put the cereal on bed upstairs. Why not just eat down here? Why not? Why am I going to stay in somebody else's room? Like, I get I'm house sitting, but... Uh, did I leave that open? Also, what bed? That bed? I'm going to assume this bed. Walked in. Wait, there isn't a bed in here. What am I doing? Wait, no! This bed. Put cereal on bed. Right there. Lay on the bed. You didn't, uh, you didn't leave your card with me, agent. That would have been helpful. Uh... On me. Use.
I guess I have no choice but to watch a horror movie. Alright. Falling asleep to a horror movie in a horror movie situation. I didn't even eat the cereal. It's 2.43 a.m. Because of course it is. Uh, yeah, no, that was for sure a tall mother... Also, where the hell did the remote go? I think it's rather obvious what the hell is going on, my guy. Rather obvious what the hell is going on. I left all these lights on. Also, all of these doors busted the f*** down. Yeah. Yeah. Now you're gonna be a little concerned, my guy? Spook tubers to play your game. Alright, well that's just meta, so... For sure. Oh, that's dark. Uh-huh. I didn't hear the clapping. Right, prepare for jump scare. Three, two, one. Hmm. Yep. Yay, yay, yay. What? What did you just say? Come here, you mother. Oops. Rubber ducky. Rubber ducky! Get a rubber ducky! Where are you? What is that sound? Hi, buddy. Hold shift to run. Holding shift to run. Q. Boy, he was coming. He uh, was a coming. What the hell was that? I need to get as far away from here as possible. Now? Now you think that? Oh, look! Blood! That's great! It didn't work. It didn't work. Marco's dead. Should have, uh, should have gone to investigate that, but... Marco's dead. A lot of help that was. I kept running until I reached the nearest police station. While investigating, the authorities found Marco's lifeless body in his house. Meanwhile, Maxim's remains were found stuffed in the trash bag outside his house. Oh, so that was Maxim himself. Their neighbor, Savo, has disappeared under similar circumstances. His remains have yet to be found. Despite the eerie scratches on the walls and my harrowing account, no trace of the creature is ever discovered. The case remains unsolved, leaving an unsettling mystery behind. So I was right in saying that this would be closer to the Conjuring's hide and clap game, but with a clapper. So it was both, I guess. Now I have a theory, because it was stated that Savo, the guy in the middle whose remains have yet to be found, was raving so much about the clap clap security system which is what the box is and what we saw and marco got himself one and he was murdered and maxim was already dead by the time we got in for the house sitting and he had it installed this is some form of entity that exists within the security system that is why it didn't chase me out of the house it just stopped at the window it cannot exist outside of the house I'm on to you. Now, my guess is, is there are a couple other endings, just based on the achievements, as well as the fact that I'm pretty sure I can get killed by the entity, whatever it is. So if you'd like to see me get those other endings, leave a like on this video, put down a comment saying, do it, or you know, something along those lines. And I will come back and play this game again, and I will be following this indie creator in order to see what other nightmare files they come up with. Other than that, thank you for watching. I have been a basket case. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, stay sane. Never stop, I'll get it if I want it. Gotta make to my
myself a promise I won't quit, keep going till I got it I won't give up till I'm on top Yo, no, I ain't the type to give up If I do something, man, I do it till I get what I want I turn a business out of nothing into something I love I got a poker face, but honestly, I'm not one to bluff I flip a switch, never miss, man, I always stay up